All right, fun. Uh, welcome to the new janky workshop, everyone. And today we're going to be making a nail. That's it. Video over. <laughs> nail down. We have a nail down. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> What we're actually going to be making is the weapon from Hollow Knight, um, sharing the same name. Um, Hollow Knight is a 2D platformer where er, most characters use a weapon called a nail, which is fairly simplistic in design. It's more just like a long triangle and... And it looks like this. Yeah. There we go. So that's what we're going to be making today. So we're going to make some sparks. Yeah. Let's do it. Um, so we went to our local big box store, the blue one. Uh, we got a piece of mild steel here that we can weld and forge and stuff like that for the handle. And then this big chunkaroo of steel, which I think we paid a lot less for than it should have cost. Because um, with everything we bought, it was like 12 bucks. And... This seems like it would cost more than 12 bucks. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so, this is welding steel, mm -hmm. PLT, whatever that means. Um, it's one by four, uh, sorry, one and a quarter inch by four inches by one foot. Um, so this is what we're gonna use. We're gonna make the shape on here, angle grind it out, and start forging the sides and grinding it and do all that fun stuff. So, yeah, that's what you're gonna see. Are you ready? Loud noise? Wanna plug your ears? wasn't as loud as I expected. It made my ears ring. Alright. Alright, so, we've got this, we know this is four inches, it says it four inches wide on the back, so half of that is going to be two inches. So I've got my whiteout marker here, and I'm going to take my little small DFM square here, and hopefully this fits through here, and it does not. So, that's useful. Dang. Um, let's try a pencil, shall we? Most likely. This will definitely fit there. Can't see anything. Yeah, because so it's steel. It's graphite on steel. That sounds like it would be a metaphor on on some pointless attempt. <laughs> it does. And then we're gonna take this. Oh look, we can actually see it now. Look at that. That's beautiful. If you don't have a pencil sharpener at your shop, I highly recommend one. Or not. <laughs> because it just steals the depths. I swear I have another one somewhere. <laughs> so then we take this, and we want to go from uh, the top to the corner. Right? Mm -hmm. So we're making a triangle. This thing sucks. Yeah, this thing again. That's much better. That gives us a line we can... <laughs> Uh, I, I was saying. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? No, oh, that's up. <laughs> well, we can use the graphite pen pencil on the white. How's that? Yeah. Janky. New janky workshop. And also, your ruler is going to have a permanent white edge to it. That one looks somewhat better. <laughs> yeah. We'll just go with the inside of that and call it a day. Now, I'm gonna hold uh, this in front of the fan over there and let it dry real quick so I can use the graphite on it. Oh, we gotta cut into the bottom? Oh, yeah. oh all right. Let's see, this is why you're here. So like that, kind of? Yeah, that would be good. Let me go dry this and then we'll outline it in chalker. Spray paint. <laughs> I'm gonna get actual pencil pencil and retrace our lines over the white so we can actually see them. Oh, is it doing anything? Oh, yep. Kind of is better than nothing at all in this case. Put that on a t-shirt. <laughs> 
<laughs> Shop our merch. Kind of. It's almost perfect. We already forgot it. Not by recording this, son. Yep. <laughs> there we go, ish. We kind of know what we're thinking we might want to do ish yeah. stuff. Yep. All right. I think it's time to throw some sparks. What do you think? Yeah. All right. Make some sparks. Let's load this up in the vise here. You can see we have our pattern drawn. We are going to make our first cut of that angle for the side of the triangle. So we're going to be throwing some sparks. And of course, I'm doing this in Birkenstocks because why not? I'm smart that way. Did I burn the battery out already? Really? I think it might have killed the battery. <laughs> I'm gonna that move you through a painting. Huh? Uh, actually, uh... Oh, that is on fire, isn't it? Uh, why are you on fire? I'm gonna deal with this one. Oh, for those not saying this... Oh, I think a moth just flew out of there. There we go. There's a fire. There's a fire. We're gonna wet this down nicely. A little water everywhere. There was. 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 We dealt with it. Say hi to the internet, Eva. What? Say hi to the internet. I'm gonna bring this outside. Very hot. Very, very hot. I need a spritzer. Where's my spritzer? Here's my spritzer. There we go. All right, back in. I think we just burned through another battery. What? No, no, tell me what. I'm thinking maybe. Like survey and shop every uh, just to make sure that nothing else catches on fire. Yeah, no, we still see more smoke. We should um, definitely respond to that. This might be a multi day video, Luke. Huh? The way we're going through batteries here. You need to be a spritzer. Almost there. That's gonna hurt you. All right, there's one side. Yep. Spritzer. There are my vice. I'm sure my vice loves being soaked in water too. That, that, that was first. New experience. Yay! Fire. Fire is fun. Not really. All right. We, so we kind of have one side. We can grind that out, but we need to, to get rid of the chunkage. We're, we're, we're getting rid of chunkage right now. All right, so you'll see here we have literally like a bunch of flies. So this is a bug assault intermission. There's Lucas with a bug assault. Ready to go, buddy? Mm -hmm. All right, begin firing. I think really all I'm accomplishing from doing this is spooking them. Upper left hand corner, there's three. Oh, there are a bit more than three. We don't set anything on fire again. Yep. Let's see how we go. Really? Did I burn this battery out too? Yep. Wow. Okay. And threw it. And battery is now.
Here. Go and spritz to me. Can I say spritz? Come over and spray it. Alright. Spritz! Thank you. Spritz. Thank you. Spritz. New battery. Again. Powered is just dying on me too quickly. I'm gonna pause this real quick. Record it now. shape that is very very hot of what we're looking to do so now we need to cut this bit right here cut into that spritz all right we are spritz Spritzing. all right good success there you go all right, you need to take a rest for a little bit, buddy. Spritzy. All right. Back. Mega spritz. Mega spritz. All right, next up, we're gonna do some grinding on this to get into a rough shape. I think this might be too OP for my grinder. <laughs> simultaneous, you simultaneous found the, simultaneously found the best and worst metal. Right? Best metal for anything else. Worst metal for this project. Well, I don't have the right tools for this project is the problem. Yeah, fair enough. Season up my grinder. side for a few minutes. After a lot of grinding and a lot of missed video, we have our rough shape for the nail. 
from Hollow Knight. Made out of quarter inch thick steel. Which is surprisingly very high quality. Yes, it's burning out my batteries and my grinder and it's definitely a little overpowered for my grinder that I have. Um, but we have a rough shape. And I think that's where we're going to leave it for today. And then we'll pick back up on this um, in a couple days and start to get a bevel on the edge, add some more detail to it, and then put a handle on it, which is going to be this chunk of chunk of metal right here. This one, Lucas and I had a blast making this project together, from forging to welding, um, bringing a piece to life. Um, and to spend some awesome father-son time together. Uh, that was probably the best part about doing this project with him, uh, was all the quality time we spent together and learning new skills and playing around. And seriously, we got to make a steel nail. How cool is that? Anyhow, uh, we hope you enjoyed this portion of the series. It's going to be a three-part series in total where we work on this project together. Um, so as the new videos drop, we're going to do one weekly for the next three weeks on Thursdays. Um, so stay tuned. At 10 a.m. on Thursdays, these are going to drop. These uh, three videos in the Eroded Hollow Knight Nail video series with my son. Um, so keep an eye out on those Thursdays for more information. And find the links in the description below to actually watch the other videos in the series if you're interested and i'll put together maybe a playlist or something um i'm gonna figure out how to do that or maybe he'll figure out how to use the card thingies who knows we'll find out Because of this project and all the memorable quotes and everything that has come out of it we have a bunch of merch for sale now like this one and this one. And this! Ah. There's also this one. And this! And this one. Buy yours and the link below. Right now. Do it. And this! And this! But without the hole I put in it. Sorry about that. Yes, it's blank. What? No, seriously, look at it. Sweet, and so is this one. What the actual fun? So, you can find links to all the quotes and stuff like that in the videos below them, um, as well as a general link to our Tee Public store that has all of these merch in it. So please, if you want to support us, buy a t-shirt, hit like, subscribe, follow us, hit the bell, do all that stuff. It would all be very helpful. Um, and let us know, have you built a project like this with um, uh, your kid before or by yourself um, and just learning new skills and see how you did at it? Share us. Share it, share it below. Tell, it, uh, tell us about it. Tell us about what you'd like to see. Would you like to see more videos like this? Would you see less videos like this? All feedback is good feedback, and we take it in. So thank you very much for sticking with us through this, and I hope you enjoyed it. We had a lot of fun doing it, and we hope to do a lot more like it. So thank you all. Please like, subscribe. Love you. Bye.